think we have fundamental issues in our country in terms of inequality and lack of resources. But the answer is not to pit one against each other. I think if 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 the GOP or those who who are crying foul against immigrants cared about housing and medical care and uh, opportunity, they should be fighting for you know. Uh, to, to increase the minimum wage, they should be fighting for making sure people have labor rights. They should be uh, fighting for expanding access to healthcare. So, so we just have to be clear, right? Like, who's really fighting for uh, one another? I think that um, you know we need to sort of shift the conversation about how to uh, sort of address these long-standing issues in our communities. I think the second point I want to make, and this is based on years and years and years of research. Immigration is an asset to the United States. Immigrants improve our economies, vitalize our communities. So it is not correct to say that immigrants are sort of like a negative to our economy. And, and this is not just because advocates say so. This is based on economic research, independent economic research. 